Welcome to NET Vapor Reviews. Today's review is an RTA from Orgvape, the Druga RTA that I received from Orgvape. Orgvape. So, what do I think about this RTA? Well, very impressed indeed, actually. I'm vaping it on my Dreamer one, version 1.5 mech mod. It looks quite nice indeed as a kit. And uh, the vape is very impressed. Before we talk about this RDA, uh, let's go down to the build and wick and then we'll come back on top and talk about it a bit more. Right, today we'll have a look at the Druga RTA by Orgvape. So, you can see the includes, just changing my glasses, Druga RTA, double uh, bubble glass, four O-rings, four screws, authenticity label, and Oak vape. Let's open it and here you get your the color of your RTA. <coughs> Come on. Okay, here we go. So um specifications 24 millimeter 3d airflow low profile capacity 2.4 mil on the straight and 3.5 on the bubble flavor chasing okay what do you get in the bag you get o-rings and spare screws no coil that's it is the RTA so there's the bubble glass let's take out the RTA and put away the box and let's have a look so the logo of Ogwe Druga very elegant as usual not not too busy just nicely done and on the base, um, by Vape House and Org Vape. Vape House and Org Vape. 2792 is quite a lot. Nicely protruding, so you can use it on a hybrid mech mod. Right, let's have a look. This is a 810 white bore. The O-ring is inside the top cap. And here you go, nice size juice wells. Yeah. And you can look right down into the deck. Okay, let's open up the deck and the airflow. We'll go through the airflow soon. Now let's have a look at the chimney. Nicely built dome. I already washed it. To take out the glass is simple. Everything here is nice machined. and let's now have a look at the deck well here you've got the honeycomb well not honeycomb quite no you can see the air hole system here and here and over here juice well the juice was it's again a raised style deck um 
Yeah. They all have raised decks. Um, when when it comes to the to the org vape in the Druga series. Uh, the intake RTA that I have reviewed recently is also same idea. But you get an idea of how the deck looks like. Right, let's build the deck. Right, so you got four posts. Um, you got a four post system so you can put in a coil um, either clockwise or anti-clockwise so the coil I'm using today is for this tank is um, let's have a look frame staple um, no, multi strand See, I've got already a coil that I prepared. You see, because when you get them, it's sort of you need to shape out the legs. So this coil is um, fuse Clapton 0 0.32 ohm, three millimeter. You can see all the description. I fully recommend this. This uh, you get quite a nice. Um, NI80 coils, fuse claptons, all sorts. You can see yourself um, where you can get here. It's quite a nice selection. And you get the cotton as well. And it's very priced, reasonably priced. Okay, so let's get on with building this coil. It'll be easier to do with my bare hands. So you have to get it in sideways. I do the other way around. <coughs> Which way am I doing it? Um, let's do this, this way. That's it. It's in. Now I'm going to put in my co coiling tool to hold it in place. And we just have to tighten it. Now just hold this with the other hand. Now on this tank, it's thankfully not reverse threading um, because on the intake from org vape and mic vapes i reviewed is reverse and, and that sometimes is quite confusing okay let's straighten this out and it looks We want to lower it a bit towards the airflow. Yep, perfect. You can see how it's right by the airflow. Yep. Okay, now sometimes it gets a bit loose. So you just have to tighten it. Let's cut off the leads. You know what? I don't want it to 
fly okay make sure you cut them quite close I mean you could really get a bit closer that's fine okay let's fire it up give it a dry small short pulses don't overdo it get off all the, the hot spots that's it and then let's see what ohms 0 0.33 and that was uh, this was the multi the multi strand 0 0.32 yeah so 0 0.33 is, is fine okay Of a vape while it's cooling down a second. I'm vaping my Pioneer. Okay, let's wick it. So I use organic Japanese Muji's as usual. Always make sure there is resistance, but not too much. Now, looking at the juice um, ports here, and it's not so big, so, but since it's an RD, RTA direct along, you don't want to um, thin them too much, but so what I do is I load the cotton to the deck, press down, so I get an idea where to cut, and I check it to see that it barely touches the deck, and this is perfect. You can see exactly right. So now the second side will be easier. So it looks like a bit of a bow tie um, style. Yep, perfect. Right. Um, I think I'll thin them a bit because the juice, the, the um, wicking ports are a bit um, not on the big sides. And when it comes to GTA style, you don't want to having them condensed when they go down, otherwise they don't wick properly. And then when you start getting, um, you know, burn taste of your flavor because it's burning cotton not the uh, it's not saturated enough and also this gives them a nice fluff at the same time Right, straighten it out. Other side. All right. Let's start start tucking them in.
gently without forcing them down they'll find their own place so you see you get like a tuft of cotton over here yeah that's the way it should look like so that's that's the way so you got the cotton appearing here and the liquid goes down here and it will wick it up no problem but never force it down so if you need you thin it out a bit and to make sure you get it right 0.34 okay sometimes it happens when you wick now for this i'm using this juice i reviewed this ages ago it's called reggae soul rebel mango lychee and guava it's a very nice um refreshing liquid <clears throat> that's what i fancy for this tank Mm, smells very um, very refreshing give this a nice moisten and um, I already I already put VG on the sides here on the threading and we'll just put in the juice to pause it I'm afraid um, I'm the only one here and I'm expecting a delivery so uh, just give me one second sorry about that um, that's what happens when I come in early um, I'm the only one here so I've got to see to the door sometimes okay I think it's full enough uh, let's put the top cap back on it's like a half twist very comfortable to open and close right so this tank is basically ready to vape all right so i'm going to use the top side light mod for now and we'll check the airflow so before we do that let's check the airflow this comes stop and start yeah oh, very nice smooth airflow eventually I'm going to use this on my um, mech mod because it's protruding nicely uh, but for now I'll use it on the top side light used as a mod not as a skunking and it registers as a 0 0.33 ohm and that one was a 0 0.32 that's fine 40 watts will start off with fully open let's give us a vape very airy direct to long very little restriction on air if I close it halfway 
perfect for me. The flavor is superb. Really nice flavor. Airflow is smooth. Um, yeah, so I'm going to use this now for a few days and we'll finish this review. Okay, for you it will be just a second. So I have been using the Druga RTA for, for nearly a week now and it's one of those RTAs that I've got zero issues with. Simple. There is RTAs that are very good on flavor but sometimes you need to get the wicking right and if you don't get the wicking right you get this burnt flavor in your mouth. Some RTAs um, leak sometimes from the airflow. Uh, some RTAs have got a problem with the flavor. This RTA, I must say, has, it has been issue free, completely issue free. No leaking, no flavor is perfect every single draw. I'm very, I'm very impressed with this quality and with the quality of build and flavor. Since the build and wick section that you've just seen, I have changed the wick twice and I've changed the liquid twice. In here now I've got Kenzie from 12 Monkeys. The flavor is on point and it, the airflow is super smooth. Now when I, when I said below that the airflow is airy when it's fully open, yes, it is airy but not overly airy. It is very similar to the Kelpie. This is the Kelpie, wide open. It's nearly identical to the Kelpie on the airflow. I personally like it half, half closed and the, it gives me that lovely little restriction on, on, the, on the draw. I can't uh, is not is no I can't find any cons with this RTA. It's very elegant. The only uh, um, um, brand you got uh, the branding is only this uh, logo on the, on the chimney. Nothing else. Um, the knurling on the top really helps you to grip, and it's just a little twist, and it's and it opens the juice flow very easy. Um, the airflow is super easy, just turning your, 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 the wheel. I mean, all in all, this is a perfect RTA. And it looks very nice as well on my Dreamer. Yeah. Now, size comparison, I mean, this is 39.5 millimeters. If I put it against the Kelpie, the Kelpie is quite bigger and beefier. Um, against the Zeus, for instance, much smaller. So it is a compact. Now the Zeus, don't get me wrong, is a very nice RTA. <laughs> wow. I haven't been used this for, for two days, so it gave a pop. Okay, um, so you can see the size comparison. I mean, it is quite quite a bit smaller. Um, Flavor-wise, it will compete with the Kelpie and the Zeus, no problem. The Zeus has got, um, you know, that's if you have watched the review on the Zeus, it's got that chimney that, you know, right on on the deck. Um, and I can't see the flavor, well, I mean, if you don't get it right, that chimney in the right position, you get some leaking from the Zeus. Um, the Kelpie needs wicking right. This has been easy, easy, just easy to live with. Easy to live with. And the flavor is superb, on point. And I love the airflow, and the build quality is nice, it's elegant. Well, what else could I say? 
it's 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 a very nice all round solid RTA. Now down below, when I was when I was looking at the deck, I said it looked like the um, the intake the intake mouse to long RTA that I have reviewed. Well, that wasn't correct. This is the intake mouse to long RTA that I already recorded the build and wick, but I'm still testing it. And I must give you a little spoiler. This is another superb RTA. But this re the review on the intake will be hopefully next week or the end of the week. We'll see how it goes. But that's just a correction on what I said below on the deck. To build this deck is easy. You've seen, well, you just have to feed in the coil sideways in. Uh, I put in a very nice beefy three uh, millimeter uh, inner diameter coil, um, a 0 0.32 ohm, very nicely fit. When it went in, it was perfect. The wicking is easy. Um, very nice RTA, I must say. I'm, I'm very impressed with Org Vape in general. They produce solid, uh, hassle-free vaping tanks. RTAs and mouse to lump. Very impressed. Yep. So, to sum up my review on this um, very good quality RTA, um, very good overall quality of, of machinery, easy to live with, hassle free. Um, never had a problem with the wicking, never had a problem with anything at all with this tank. I mean, this has been on the, except when I recharged the battery, um, completely dry, completely dry, no leakage, no nothing. Um, it just, it's a very nice RTA and the flavor is good. It's not too big, not too small. Yeah, it's a bit bigger than the Gear RTA that I, don't, I haven't got here at the moment to compare it, but the Gear RTA is a bit shallow. But don't forget that you've got your juice capacity in here. You've got 2.4 mil on the straight. That's quite good. And three and a half with the bubble. I prefer it with the straight. It just looks more elegant with this mod, with this uh, mech mod. Um, it's a 24 millimeter. I'll put the whole spec below for you to have a look. Um, the 3D airflow. Now, when, when I first looked at it, it does look a bit like a honeycomb, but it's not a honeycomb, right? It's the 3D coming from either direction from and going upwards underneath the coil. Very nice, smooth airflow. What else could I tell you? I think that is it very very happy with this RTA from Orgvape the Druga RTA I must thank uh, Orgvape for sending it to me and um, much appreciated yeah it's a very nice RTA if it wasn't good I wouldn't have even reviewed it but the fact is that I'm very impressed with this RTA full credit and I'm even I'm very impressed with the mouth to long RTA from the intake, but that will come, the review will come shortly. Very, very good RTA. Okay, until the next review, take care, enjoy your vape, bye bye for now.